Hello, I'm Erica, and today is the 16th day of Black History Month 2019. A book I'd like to see brought to the screen is The Secrets of Mary Bowser. The Secrets of Mary Bowser is a perfect example of what historical fiction should be. She did an amazing job at using what is known about Mary and information that can be assumed about Mary based on the time period. She used all those things to create an amazingly awesome story. Not much is known about Mary Bowser. It is known that she was born enslaved as Mary Jane Richards in 1846. She served as a Union spy during the Civil War in connection with Elizabeth Van Lu, and that she married Wilson Bowser in 1861. We also know that after her time as a spy, she used numerous different names to give lectures about her experiences and to run a school for freedmen in Georgia. For a quick history drop, Elizabeth Van Lu is an abolitionist who created and ran an extensive spy ring called the Richmond Underground for the Union Army during the Civil War. Being a black woman enabled Mary to pose as an enslaved servant in the Confederate White House and spy on Jefferson Davis's family. Various Union military leaders benefited from Bowser's work because of her numerous pseudonyms it can't be pinned down exactly what contribution she gave as a spy. However, her role as a spy in the Richmond Underground Spy Ring has been confirmed. Mary is even mentioned in one of Elizabeth Van Lu's correspondences, um, which said, When I open my eyes in the morning, I say to the servant, What news, Mary? And my caterer never fails. Most generally, our reliable news is gathered from Negroes, and they certainly show wisdom, discretion, and prudence, which is wonderful. This came from a diary entry dated May 14, 1864. So it's very clear that Mary Bowser was an incredible spy, and she contributed much to the cause for the Union Army. The actors I have in mind for Mary Bowser is Hannah Parrish, best known for being the first black employee at the fictional advertisement firm in the hit series Mad Men. She was amazing as the character Dawn Chambers. She most recently was in the hit film, If Bell Street Could Talk, as protective older sister Ernestine. She would be amazing as a daring intelligence by Mary Bowser. The Secrets of Mary Bowser was so enjoyable, it pulled you in. It was nail-biting moments. You really felt how brave and courageous Mary Bowser would have to be in real life. Um, you also felt the pressures of the time. And that's because of the research and she talked about that a little bit that she did so much research but at a certain point she had to stop because it was kind of paralyzing her from writing and I really appreciate that she did the amount of research that she did because it showed um, one thing in particular that I think stood out was the fact that um, Mary Bowser was originally enslaved in an urban area and a lot of times books and films can reduce slavery to just being on the plantation setting. But that's not true. There were slaves in urban areas. There was urban slavery. It wasn't just on plantations. And so the fact that Levine was able to write that in a historically accurate way shows that she did her research. And that's what's very important in historical fiction. Writing a book in a creative way, but not forgetting the historical part of the historical fiction. So, whether as a film or a limited miniseries, The Secrets of Mary Bowser would make for incredible entertainment. Levine used history to craft an amazing book that would translate perfectly to the screen. Someone should write it.